Yeah, that was a roller coaster. Well, welcome back to another video, guys. My name is Leaf, and we have unlocked something pretty interesting this time around. So, I was playing with the game files, right? I was working in good old Foxborough Zoo, and I was making a train ride, right? Oh, big spoiler alert for that. But, um, I was just hanging out with the boys, you know how it goes. And I was thinking, like, oh, you know, what would happen if I just, like, unlock the speeds in this? Because I know you can do that. It's just, it, it's, it's a simple file change, you know? And so, upon going through these files, I was able to make the max speed pretty much anything we want. So we can go all the way up to 268 miles per hour. That's pretty good. But I'm going to leave it at 3 just for this. And we are actually... Not gonna go in that train, we're gonna start right at the start. I'm gonna go to my favorite POV right here. And we finally have roller coasters in the game, so yeah. Uh, I'm pretty excited to show you guys how these work. I'm gonna build one on this video right here and I'm gonna show off a few others I made so far. Uh, this one is one that I kinda did just like right off the bat. I was just like... I want to use like the South America map. I want to have it go down like all those hills and stuff. So I made like a little bit of a South American theme going on with this one. But yeah, we can ride these rides. This is still a work in development. So unfortunately, I'm not going to release this just yet. It's not to the point where I actually want it to be released. But I will eventually just work my way through and try and develop these into full fledged roller coasters. But yeah, look at these swooping turns. I was able to like unhinge all the limits that we have like all the restrictions that we have within the builder so now we can do like loop-de-loops -loops, as you just saw we can do like insane bank curves kind of like this probably not that safe because you know there's not any seat belts in here but you know it's still all in good fun i mean we can ride the rides sit on here but that's not really my favorite view uh what we're actually going to do we're actually going to load into some of my other maps and we can actually see some of the stuff that I've been working on. So if you guys have any like ideas, any information, any suggestions that you have for these, please shout them out. I'm already talking with like Beyond Drew TV. I'm talking with S Dan Wolf about like what they want because you guys know they're the big coaster nerds. They know more of that stuff than I do. But yeah, we're already talking about like removing the top of the, I guess it's the train ride. So yeah, just get ri getting rid of like the top of the cable cars right there. I guess shades is what they really are. But um, yeah. So here's another one that I made. Just a little bit of like a show of practice. Here is a little boat ride. And I actually do like to sit down in the seat in this one because it's actually really fun. But yeah. Now our boat ride can actually go up and down. It can do bank curves. It can do pretty much anything. And yeah. We have a lot of stuff going on with these. I am working on getting, like, velocity working. I'm working on getting, like, all this stuff to work. But, you know, we'll get there eventually. It's all in good fun. And we even have stuff like this. This is also the mod showcase map. Like, I, I just default load in here now. But, yeah, here we go. We're going down another little loop-de-loop. -loop. Like, I'm having so much fun with this. I've stopped making all new animals altogether the minute I uncovered this. This is just way too fun to mess with. But yeah, I'm still working on like, you guys saw how quickly that came up there. You guys saw like, how it doesn't really slow down at all. But that's also a problem with like, if you wanted to go down hills and gain speed like a roller coaster, I need to like figure out what values actually make it slow down when going back up. So that's something I'll look into a little bit later. I have this going on. I'm not going to give you guys like the nausea fest that happened right there, but um, yeah, we even have the monorail working and unfortunately you do sit sideways, but you know, that's something that I'm going to look into fixing soon enough. But yeah, this one's probably the most roller coaster of them all. I'm going to see what I could do about making these default to have three cars, not cars, but um, yeah, cars. Because of vehicles and then cars. Yeah, so that's how that works. Yeah, I guess. But yeah, might as well show you guys, like, all the stuff it works with. It even works with the Jeeps, too. So, if you want to go a little upside down in the Jeeps, you can do that as well. 
Nick is also working on a little thing with the Jeeps too for the Africa pack, so keep an eye out for that. There are some problems with this though. For instance, um, there's no chain lift, which I feel like would be one of the most important things to have, but I'm gonna work on porting it over from Planet Coaster. So we're gonna see what I can do in regards to that. We're actually gonna jump maps once again. We're actually gonna go into, I'm, I'm losing track of all of these, honestly. We're gonna go into testing. Hopefully this is the right one. I'm not really too sure. Also, while we're in this little intermission, if you guys haven't already, be sure to subscribe to me. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna keep on like updating you guys on like all this wacky shit that's happening. So I would really appreciate it. Make sure to even comment too. Again, let me know like any improvements I can make to the current ride systems that would, you know, benefit you guys to make like roller coasters and stuff. And yeah, once this is officially out, I think I may even host like a little contest for all you guys for like a roller coaster building, probably combining like habitats and roller coasters. If you guys like that idea, be sure to let me know because it seems like a pretty fun idea. But yeah, we have a few other things over here. We're actually going to slow this down. And yeah, we can even do like underwater submarines so imagine just like sitting down here and watching all the dolphins go by the way dolphins are out uh this is a little sneak peek into like next week's mod showcase we have like the bottle nose and we have the common dolphin wherever it went i believe they're right over here yeah look at them they're beautiful but yeah we can do some fun stuff like this this is absolutely insane but yeah that's like one of the things we have going on um, and we can also do wacky stuff like that. I've just been, like, testing everything over here. Even, like, um, these over here, I'm actually going to speed it up. Oh, that's way too fast. But yeah, you can sit down in here. Go through the loop, the loops. <laughs> it's really fun, guys. I'm so happy I'm, like, starting to really flesh this out. This is my little test with like velocity and stuff, so I would have it go like down a nice little incline. And I would be testing the values to see like which one goes down like the fastest. I'm still trying to figure it out though, so I'll keep you guys posted on that. If you're not in the modding discord already, be sure to join. Oh my god, it's like the little engine that could. Look at him go. But um... Yeah, if you guys aren't in the modding discord already, be sure to join because I will be keep on posting like stuff like this all the time. And yeah, I am thinking we can go into like showing off how like the builder works, might as well. So what would be a kind of cool one to do? I guess we can go for um, Riverboat. I just love how this one works. So yeah, of course, like you could never do like this with the Riverboat. You can't even do that with, like, most rides in, like, Planet Coaster and stuff, but... Yeah, we can do that. Go straight down, we can do nice little curves like that. I also unhinged the, uh, length of how long you can make tracks, so I made it up to 50 meters. Because, hey, why not? I feel like that would benefit people. And instead of restricting creativity, I feel like we should embrace it. So we could do... Oh god, that's a little too sharp of a turn. But yeah, we can do stuff like this. We can go straight up. And if I could get this angle right, we can do a nice little loop-de-loop. -loop. I'm still not a fan of, like, how... Like, going straight into a, a loop goes. But I'm sure I can figure out how to make that work a little bit better. And yeah, you guys can do like corkscrews and all that stuff. I'm not really too into the coasters, but I know a lot of people are. So it's going to be really cool to see like all the guys from Bro Nation at least use this and like, you know, bring their coasters to life in this new, new game for them. Yeah, we can do stuff like that. We can do like barrel rolls. So if I just increase that all the way. And keep on going, and keep on going. I'm not sure if this will work, but hey. It's worth a shot. Yeah, we can just auto-complete that. I'm too lazy to finish that, but... 
This is still a problem that I have. I don't like the fact that we need to place the entrance down, place an exit. I wish we could just test it outright. But that might be something I can look into as well. This is all just very like in the testing phase at least right now. But yeah, I hope you guys like what this has so far. I'm going to just test this with you guys right now just to show you off like what we can do. And I'll leave you guys at it. So yeah, we can hop in our little boat. And we can build up speed. I just really love how this works. Granted, like, once we unlock the um, velocity and stuff, it'll be so much better. But yeah, we can do, like, curves like that. We can break your neck just like that. And yeah, we come all the way right back to the station. So this is actually really good for, like, a lot of builds, too. Especially, like, not even roller coasters, but now we can have, like, multi-level boat rides. So you could go down, like, a waterfall or something. You can, like... You can really unhinge, like, all the limits of your creativity. I mean, look at this stuff over here. Like, if we just test this. It's insane, the level of stuff we're able to do now. And this was, like, the first one I did where I, like, unlocked all the limits and stuff. I was never really good at Planet Coaster. I'll admit, I never really liked it too much. But, hey, this is... This is a good happy medium for me. Yeah, might as well show off, like, this one over here, because this was, like, the first ride that I kind of created. Um, might as well show it off from the seat, and then we can go. But yeah, this is, like, a little monkey, monkey habitat. I decided to box them all up because they do still stop, like, all the rides. But yeah, it's just still really fun to mess with, and I can't wait to see what you guys do with it. And yeah, I really do hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you're new here, if this video caught your eye, be sure to leave a like, drop a comment, and maybe even subscribe if you do like this. I will keep posting updates, as I said, like a million times in this video, but I'm pretty sure you guys already know that by now. My name is Leaf, and thank you guys so much for watching another Planet Zoo video. Take care. Thank you.